Hello to you out there in Radio Land. Uh, let's do some monopoly analysis here. So this is a firm. Okay, and a firm faces a downward sloping demand curve, marginal revenue curve inside of that, and uh, this curve actually could be extended uh, as the demand curve keeps going out. Right about there, and that means that the marginal revenue curve is going to keep going uh, too. Okay. So um, we want to just look at a few things here to, to figure out what's going on here. So first of all, if the firm wants to profit maximize, it's going to produce where its marginal revenue equals its marginal cost. And so that happens. Here's their marginal cost. Here's the marginal revenue. So that happens right here. Okay. So what quantity is that? That's quantity M. And quantity M could be a number, right? It could be... Uh, 200 right whatever it happens to be on the graph right and then they're not going to charge price C because uh, that would be a competitive price they're going to charge uh, up here they're going to follow it to where it hits the demand curve it hits the demand curve at point F but they're going to charge price A so let's just imagine that this is uh, ten dollars right that this is uh, ten dollars so the way to figure out the monopolists uh, revenue is to calculate Remember, total revenue equals price times quantity. So in this case, total revenue is going to be this $10 times 200, which is going to equal $2,000. So that's the total revenue, right? Now, um, let's say that uh, if I want to figure out profit, this B here is, um, you know, let's say that's $7, right? So this uh, we'll call it, uh, we'll do purple here. Go Suns. All right, so this, this right here, this whole big thing here that I just tried to shade here, this is their cost, right? This is their total cost. So total cost is going to be the cost, the average cost, which in this case is 7 times 200. Okay, so it's going to be 1,400. So to figure out their profit, it's just the difference. Okay, so profit which we're going to use uh, pi for uh, is going to be 2,000. So it's it's total revenue minus total cost. So it's 2,000 minus 1,400. So it's 600 when this is a single price monopolist. Okay. Now, if this was a competitive market, I'll use this red color here. Competitive market, or if it's be what's best for society, it's going to be what the marginal benefit is, equaling the marginal cost. And this marginal benefit for everybody is the demand curve. It's how much everybody demands it. So where does the demand curve meet marginal cost? It meets it at this point. Okay. So what that means is that there's this, uh, so this is the monopoly, right? We're not going to get, we're not going to go from M to Q. We'll call this 250. Um, we're not going to get that. So uh, what this means is that we're going to lose out. All of these, all of these demanders are going to lose out and all of the, this supply is going to lose out. Okay. And so what this means here is this shaded area right here is going to be the dead weight loss. Okay, so how to calculate the dead weight loss? It's just one half base times height. So uh, what is the base of this triangle? Well, it's uh, from C, and we'll say that C is uh, I don't know, six. So six to ten is four. So the distance here is four. Okay, so it's, it's one half, uh, four times the distance from M to Q, which is 200 to 250, and that's going to be 50. Okay, so four times 50 is 200, and then half of that is 100. That's the dead weight loss. Remember, the, the dead weight loss formula is one half base times height of whatever it should be. Okay, so I'll use a different color here, use this yellow. This is where we would be if it was competitive, and that's that old graph that we've done all the way back here, right, where we had supply, demand, price, quantity. This is the efficient market, right? So if this market was efficient, we'd be right here, but it's not efficient. So because the monopolist is going to produce just an M, we're going to lose out on this red section, okay? I uh, hope that answers your question. Thank you. Bye.